Parents uh, trying to stop Fort Worth schools from enforcing mask rules for students made an emergency request today. They've asked an appeals court now to step into this. Jason Allen is in Fort Worth to explain the newest twist in this legal battle over masks. An attorney for parents with students in Fort Worth schools filed this 500 plus page petition with the Second Court of Appeals today and also this emergency motion to go with it. And this is after it appeared that parents had won at least a temporary victory over masks in schools here. But this is what parents are asking the Second Court of Appeals to give them now emergency relief to prevent further implementation or enforcement of the illegal face covering rule during the appeal. The reason for this is an allowance in Texas law for school districts to appeal a case and while they do that, set aside any orders in the case. For this issue, that would mean a ruling from a judge last week telling the district it can't enforce the mask rule would be on hold. Now, Fort Worth ISD didn't change its position as students return today after the Labor Day holiday. As of now, it still plans to only enforce the rule if and when it can legally do so. Parents aren't convinced, arguing to the appeals court that even while the restraining order has been in effect since school started, there were reports of demanding mask usage in a classroom by teachers, indicating a lack of concern about what the district states. It wasn't clear today if the school district has given any instruction to staff about following the injunction order from the court or not. It also wasn't immediately certain just how soon the Court of Appeals might act on this new emergency request from parents. In Fort Worth, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News. Jason, thank you.